Happy Tuesday, everybody. I'm Miguel Sanchez. Welcome to episode 432 of Mochi Monsters by Me. Man, we're glad you're here today. <clears throat> hey, guess what? A new logo Hershey Mochi just came out today. Yay! It was about McDonald's. Yes. Episode 13 just came out. It was about McDonald's. So yeah, if you haven't seen it yet, please go watch it right out. It's definitely worth the wait. <coughs> well, anyway, you can do so. Uh, if you want to fill in with, with Logo History Moshi, well, my Moshi Monsters Plus Toys will do the talking, they'll do the Logo Histories for you guys, so that you don't have to either. They'll do it for me. And they have new episodes every Tuesday, Thursday, and Saturday. So, keep your eyes peeled. Besides, there are only six episodes left in the season before we take a break, and they come back for season two. So make sure on board with the notifications are on, so that way you can be notified when new episodes arrive. So, please stay tuned. And by the way, Tomorrow, if if the next sleep if the next bedside premiere is a sleep story, I'll react to it on Moshi Sleep Story Reactions. So stay tuned for it. You do not want to miss it. Be uh, keep your eyes peel if it's uh, but if it's a meditation or moment or anything else like that, it gets pushed over to the next week. So, uh, 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 so keep your eyes peel. Anyways, back to the video. We got another great story. We, we got another great characters for you to take a look at today here on Moshi Monsters by Without further ado, let's get started. Yes, that's right. Episode four hundred thirty two is about tittles. Now I gotta say. This character may not be weird, but just I expected so far, it's a decorative character, and I promise you, what what are the odds of that character? It's got it's got no tail end. How could you? And no legs, no feet, no arms, no hands. Well, we're gonna find out. We're gonna we're gonna answer that today. And you have the episode four hundred thirty one where it was about Tiamo, the sparkly sweetheart, the final main machine to come out of the smiley set. I will leave that link for you on the top right corner of the screen so you can check out the video. Watch it right now. In the meantime, we will start this, shall we? <coughs> yes. Are you ready? Good. Then let's get started. All right. So who is Tiddles? Tiddles, the youngling water critter, is a decorative interactive character in Mochi Monsters. They have not appeared in any additional merchandise. Tiddles can be seen in the pod on Sledge Street and can be also be seen floating at, on the bottom left corner of the map. Okay. That's good. And the character size name is Tiddles. Occupation is Entertainment on Sledge Street. Species is youngling water critter. And yeah, that's all there is to it. We will have to do microphones starting with the character's Wikipedia. Main. Mm -hmm. Main. Somewhat of a local phenomenon in the waters around Masho City, giant tittles actually used to be teeny weeny. <coughs> I know. Born as a bit of bait at the end of Fisherman George Small's fishing hook. Yeah, fishing hook. Tittles escaped his fate as fish food by wriggling into the lake. Champion on lake loads of bottom dwelling algae. He soon became 1,500 times his former size. Oh, boy. No, oh, good, my friends. That's okay. Wet Wonder. Oh, talented Tiddles loves to... Uh, uh, talented Tiddles loves to while away his watery days by yelling to local residents and anyone who wanders his way. He is fast becoming... He is fast becoming a singing sensation, attracting large crowds with his monstrously beautiful voice. Same way as swim. Yeah, sorry. Tuneful Tiddles swims around the lake near Sludge Street. Sometimes he ducks under the water, but he soon pops up again, ready to splash out a, a new songs. Yeah, splash out a new songs. So he's that. Yeah, for yeah. <laughs> no, we, we have a plural problem. So sorry, my people. A little bit of error, but that's okay. Data file. <clears throat> Hang out in the water. Catch rays. Yeah, Likes playing till sea. <coughs> Winks. <laughs> Love it. Often spotted practicing his singing scales. Yes, I know. For the notes, no one knows where his tail actually ends. The fishies play games swimming through Tiddles' tunnels. I know. And his voice is described as the voice of a heavenly water creature. Man. <clears throat> All I can say is, it's definitely the best. Moving on to the Motionpedia, Tiddles is a local legend. He started as Bay uh, Billy Bob Bayman's hook, but escaped the clutches of an old boot and fed on algae at the bottom of the lake, growing 1,500 times his normal size. Tills is now Tills now entertains the locals with his beautifully yodeled songs. And boy, do I love it. That's okay. I really love it either. In the Ultimate Tips sticker collection, Tills is a local legend. Once he was a bait on a fisherman's hook, but he escaped after eating some special algae. Grew, grew to 1,500 times his normal size. Wow. Unbelievable. Uh, in the appearance, Tills is a colossal Murray creature who dwells within the confines of the port. He has bug-eyed ear, he has bug-eyed and clear eyes, spirited with purple pupils. 
He additionally smiles at a kindly, he additionally smiles a kindly and homely grin, which serves to hint that he is serene and gentle. <coughs> I know. No. In the fiction, relations include Bill and Bateman and Cap. Use them as bait and Cap Blood, who mentions them. Um. <coughs> no. Uh, Billy Bobby was on episode 30 of the series, so please go check it out. As for Captain Buck, his full name is Captain Buck E. Barnacle. <coughs> yeah, sorry, people. He was on episode 57, so please go check it out as well. You haven't seen yet. And finally, from the timeline, date, area, and events. Date, followed by area, then event. Date, unknown, area, date, sorry, with unknown. Motion monsters introduced as a decorative character on Slush Street. Three question mark indicate that the date is unknown. I know. 5th of January, 2012. Monstrous biographies Captain Bug. Together with Billy Bob Beam, Tittles was suspected by Captain Bug and his crew to be the shady figure who has been recently spotted on the waters. We're in the latest fashion. I know. That's great. 9th of September, 2012. Merchandise slash fiction. Ultimate Secret Collection, 4th of February, 2013. Merchandise slash fiction. Moshi Monsters, Character Sack Media, and 7th of November, 2013. Merchandise slash fiction. Mojipedia. That's the end of Tittles. <coughs> the only or the watery creature. Yeah, the only water critter. Mm. I know. Final out three for this character. I don't know what what to say about it, but not much to say about it. In the end, it's definitely not the best, but Tittles, it's okay. Let me just work right here, but yeah, that's but yeah, at the end of the day, I'll score one to ten. But uh, but I'll score one to ten. At the end of the day, I'm giving Tittles a score of seven out of ten. So nothing to worry about here. <coughs> But yes, just goes out to prove to you why you can't handle the truth, but you can handle it on your own. That's why he is the best. By my period, the end. But yeah, that's only my personal conservative opinion. Feel free to agree or disagree with any thoughts or opinions in the comment section down below. Just like that, guys, we are done. Thank you all for watching another episode of Moshi Monster Mind. We hope you guys had a lot of fun. <coughs> Tittles is out of the picture, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for tuning in today. Please stay tuned for more great content coming away tomorrow. Including Logo History number 340, where it's going to be about TVSZ1, TVSZ2, and TVSZ Duke. And I promise you, if there's a uh, logo, if there's a sleep story at a bedtime premiere on Moshi Monsters by on Moshi Sleep Story Reactions tomorrow, I will react to that. But yes, everything must come to an end. All things must come to an end. And I want to thank you all for watching today. I'm Gus Sanchez. Do it for yourself. And I will see you tomorrow on Moshi Monsters by me. Well, can't wait, guys. Another. Bernie to take a look at. Next slide, episode 433 will be about the final main washing in the Bernie set, Tiki the Pilfering Toucan. <laughs> Unbelievable. We start with the set with DJ Quack the Disco Ducky, which I really, really love. Uh, he was on episode 102. Then we went all the way down to, to Peppy the Stump Penguin on episode 297. Before moving all the way down to Professor Perplex, the Owl of Wiseness, on episode 321. Now is now we can tie. We meet the final main monster before the Super Monster League. Tuco, the 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 clamoring flamingo, which, which I don't know what that is. Which will be in the future episodes. Keep your eyes peeled for it. But but for the sec, but, but for next episode, it will be about Tiki, the Pilfer Two Cat. So be on the lookout for that. We'll see you tomorrow for episode four hundred thirty-three. So take a look at Tiki. Until then, I'm Nicholas Sanchez. Please remember to. Leave a like, share the video with your friends, leave a comment down below, and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Also, turn on notifications to not miss a new video. Please, please, subscribe to notifications to not miss a new video from me as we're on the road to 1,000 subscribers. Oh my gosh. <coughs> please, some live all over my place. But yeah, thanks for watching, guys. Have a great day. I'll be going to send you for Moshi Boss and Until tomorrow, thanks for watching. Like, favorite, subscribe. I'll see you in another video. Laters!